These are robots that were made in Africa. AI systems are able to solve complex problems and use data to make decisions in a variety of different scenarios. Now, most African countries don't have the resources to build these robots. So how did these inventors do it? Did they use scraps? Or was it just sheer determination and hard work, despite the challenges? Well, let's find out. Remember Boston Dynamics robotic dog? Well, Nigeria also has its own robotic dog. Introducing the version 2 robotic dog. In the face of increased threats to peace and safety by tourist groups such as Boko Haram in Nigeria, students from a local university have invented a robotic dog to tackle the high level of insecurity across the country. The robotic dog is powered by motion and sound sensors that give the dog a unique ability to promptly react to any threats around its owner without exposing them to any risk. This is the camera of the dog, which they also call the eyes of the dog. When the dog detects a motion through the motion sensor, after seeing, immediately it is sending an electric pulse into the dog. It sends also to the camera, and then the camera helps the owner to interact with the dog to see what the dog is actually sensing. It has two sensors, the motion sensor and the sound sensor. Just like a real dog barks when they see strange movements or hear a sharp sound, this robotic dog also starts barking to alert the owner that something is happening in its immediate environment. So when, he, when it hears a sharp sound now, you will see the, it will start barking. With this invention, the owner doesn't need to go outside to see why their dog is barking. They just have to connect this device to their robotic dog and they will be able to see everything happening within the vicinity without putting themselves at risk. So now, the new owner is able to see what the dog is seeing. As you can see from the mobile device there, the robotic dog is seeing me clearly. Remember Elon Musk's human red robot Optimus? Well, Nigeria kind of has its own and it's called Kiki Shaggy. The robot was built by Nigerian students and it stands at a height of 6 feet, weighs 60 kilograms and has a maximum speed of 10 kilometers per hour. The robot has an inbuilt camera, microphone and even face recognition. It uses Google Assistant, which has been integrated inside it, to answer questions and even have conversations. But the main goal is to have it do all this without using third-party apps like Google Assistant. My name is Kiki Shaggy. Nice to meet you. Do you remember Elon Musk's brain chip, the Neuralink, that can turn human beings into cyborgs and reverse physical disabilities? Well, two Kenyan inventors have built something similar, only this time it doesn't require surgery to implant a chip in your brain. You only need to use this device called the neuron node, which is solely powered by brain signals that convert brain messaging into electric currents, which in turn control this robotic arm. Elbow, level, Y, axis, articulation. System initiated. Wrist, level, ulna at radius, Y, axis, sequential testing. This arm has several components materials, including recycled wood that moves vertically and horizontally. Sequential testing. Check. Wrist, level, ulna at radius, Y, axis, sequential testing. Rotate, left. Check. Rotate right. Check. 
Initiating fingers, test sequence protocols. Small finger, ring finger. Check. Middle finger. Check. Thumb finger. Check. Index finger. Check. The technology makes it possible for disabled people to drive, operate a device like a computer or a phone, switch on and off lights just by thinking. The two inventors, Gadu and Kinyua, make their biorobotic prosthetic arm from electronic scraps. Both of them are college dropouts, but that didn't stop them from inventing. Remember Sophia, the talking humanoid robot? This is a good beginning of my plan to dominate the human race. <laughs> <laughs> well, Nigeria also have their own, called Omife, and it can speak over eight languages. Intelligence, AI, is a branch of computer science that focuses on creating intelligent machines that can think and act like humans. AI systems are able to solve complex problems and use data to make decisions in a variety of different scenarios. AI technology is becoming increasingly important in the world. The robot is powered by a sophisticated AI algorithm developed in Nigeria and has a deep understanding of African culture and behavioral patterns. The humanoid has a real-time understanding of its environment, including active listening and the ability to focus on specific conversation threads as it happens. It also has the ability to switch languages and interact with specific gestures. Thank you. Omife also has terrain intelligence, meaning it can navigate and move on its own on a flat surface. Which invention do you like so far? Leave a comment and a like. Ever heard of surgical robots or robots that help in the hospital? Well, Nigeria also have their own robots called My Robot. My Robot is an AI robot built by high school students in Nigeria. The robot can be controlled remotely from bed to bed and navigate through words using this Xbox controller and a VR headset. The VR headset is connected to the camera that is connected to the robot's head in which a person controlling it can see where the robot is going and navigate it. The robot can also take temperatures and communicate with patients using a tablet screen and also administer and distribute drugs to patients inside the hospital. Chest 